Hi there. How are you? Hope you will be fine. In the previous lecture, we learned how to solve a quadratic equation with the help of completing square method and solve some problem on it. In this video, we will try to learn how to solve a quadratic equation with the help of quadratic formula. So first we will define formula, then quadratic formula and we will try to prove a quadratic formula with the help of completing square method and then we will solve a problem on it as well. Here I am with maths for you by Atau Raymond. Grade 10 Mathematics Unit First Quadratic Equation Let us define a formula. A formula is a fact, a rule that uses mathematical symbols. It usually have the equality symbol. Two or more variables x, y, etc. are stand in for values we don't know yet. It shows as how things are related to each other. Now what is quadratic formula? Quadratic formula in elementary algebra the quadratic formula is a formula which provides the solution or solutions to the quadratic equation. This is what a quadratic formula. We want to derive this with the help of computing square method now. So you know you are familiar with the completing square method. There are some steps. So to prove the quadratic formula, we will first transfer the constant term of the quadratic equation to the right. And then we'll transfer the equation, quadratic equation to the harmonic form. And then we'll add the coefficient of x with divided by 2, that is b by 2 a whole square to both sides of the equation. The left hand side become a complete square, and the right taking LCM we get b square minus 4 ac divided by 2a. Now we want to uh, remove the square from the left, so we will take the square root of both sides. And we get x plus b by 2a is equal to plus minus under the cosine b square minus 4 ac divided by 2a. And after simplifying, we get the quadratic formula. Now solving this equation with the help of quadratic formula, as this equation is in the standard form. Now comparing with the standard form of the quadratic equation, a is equal to 2, b is equal to 7, and c is equal to 6. Now using these values in the quadratic formula and simplifying them, we get x is equal to minus b plus minus under the equal sign 1 divided by 4. That is x is equal to minus 7 plus minus 1 divided by 4. Separately solving them, after taking LCM, we get x is equal to minus 2 or 2 and minus 2. These are the roots of the quadratic equation. Now, tabulating them in the um, solution set is called solution set of the quadratic equation. So, do subscribe the channel, like it, and if you have any problem, please do mention in the comment box. I will try to address them. Thanks.